There is a great news about social security and the increase in benefits, but wait, there is something very important that you need to know because this will change everything for you. But first, you need to watch this. So how should social security be expanded? How? In light of the nation's looming retirement income crisis, benefits should be increased for all current and future beneficiaries. Absolutely. The Social Security 2100 Act does that but I don't believe the increase is large enough. Yes, there is an increase needed in social security benefits, but what should be the amount? Well, remember, there are several proposals, but we need to give you some very important information in this video that will certainly shock you. Remember, if you receive social security, SSI, SSDI, veteran affairs, railroad retirement disability, or any type of fixed income benefits, then we request you to please stay with us till the end of this video because we are going to give you some massive updates, including this one. There is great news and not so great news ahead for social security recipients. You heard it absolutely right we have some very important information to share with you but before I get into the details and give you everything that you need to know including the video from Congress that is very shocking for millions of seniors and social security recipients I would like to ask you for a little favor to please smash the like button on this video as it helps this video and the channel as well so let's not wait and get into the details and see what do we have and don't forget that we are going to show you that video as well so stay with us till the end if you are someone who gets the majority of retirement income from social security then you may be eager to find out how much of a raise you'll be getting come 2025 unfortunately you're going to have to sit tight a bit longer yes you heard it absolutely right things are changing rapidly for social security recipients we all know that they are struggling they need some sort of support and one of the support that they really need right now is an increase in benefits and we remember one very important proposal from Bernie Sanders calling for a $2,400 increase in social security benefits if you receive social security and you support it then write in the comment section I support $200 increase remember this $2,400 increase translates to $200 increase every single month for social security including SSI SSDI and disability recipients moving on with the details the Social Security Administration will not be able to announce an official 2025 Social Security Cost of Living Adjustment or COLA until October the 10th. That's because those COLAs are calculated based on the third quarter inflation data and since the third quarter of the year isn't over, it's too soon to have a 100% accurate number. But we can give you a number, you heard it right. We have the details of an expected number that is going to be implemented as an increase in social security benefits but before we get into the details of that number I would like to give you a little perspective of what's going on in the economy and your social security benefits remember that the grocery prices are up by 21 percent in the past three years according to a very important report and getting a 2.57 percent you heard it right let me repeat it 2.57 percent increase in social security benefits it's not less than a joke you heard it absolutely right the expected number of an increase according to the recent data from tscl the senior citizen league the increase is going to be only 2.57 percent but wait we need to wait for the official third quarter inflation data report that is also known as CPI report remember that these things are happening rapidly and these things need to be addressed as soon as possible because social security recipients are struggling right now if you receive social security and you are struggling right now then you know what it means for you the $200 increase we endorse it every person who has a brain endorses it because social security recipients need some sort of support as soon as possible going towards more details however there are estimates available for the next year's social security cola based on inflation reading that are available to date and the most recent projection puts 2025's raise at 2.5 percent yes it's exact 2.57 percent 
Well, that's not the best news. Not only is a 2.5% raise pretty mild to begin with, but it's also the smallest cost of living adjustment to arrive since 2021. In fact, Social Security recipients have gotten generous cola since inflation started surging in 2021, so a 2.5% increase might seem even more minimal. Yes, you heard it absolutely right. The inflation is up, and we all know that. The numbers are not justifying the actual situation as we all know the inflation is here the prices of basic necessities are up just as the price of groceries up by 21 percent in the past three years according to a very important report so how come the inflation is only up by 2.5 percent are these numbers fake are these numbers hoax because the election is near and this federal government needs to win the upcoming election let us know in the comments below what do you think about this whole situation because this is indeed a painful situation for millions of seniors and social security recipients who are struggling if you like our content don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel now let's watch that very important video from congress floor and see what they have to say about social security security benefits, then we'll come back and break it down for you. As I explain in detail in my written statement, an expanded social security is fully affordable. As mm -hmm. I also explain, expanding social security would strengthen the economy. An AARP Absolutely. report found that every dollar of social security benefits generates $2 in economic output. See? In 2012 alone, Social Security benefits generated over 9.2 million jobs, wow. created around $1.4 trillion in economic growth, and accounted for over $222 billion in See, tax revenues. Social Security my is actually providing money to the federal government. I include a chart showing for each of your congressional but districts not giving money to the, seniors the and number social of Social Security recipients. beneficiaries and the monthly benefit amounts that flowed to each of your districts in December 2017. So how should Social Security be expanded? In light of the nation's looming retirement income crisis, benefits should be increased for all current and future beneficiaries. Absolutely. The Social Security 2100 Act does that, but I don't believe the increase is large enough. Social Security benefits should be made fully adequate doubled or even more for America's working families. Yes, you heard it right. Social security benefits either should be doubled or tripled for social security recipients because social security benefits hasn't been changed in the past 53 years. A very shameful thing to see where federal government is spending billions of dollars on other nations while our own seniors are struggling right now. Well, let us know in the comments below what do you think about this whole situation and do you think that this federal government is actually serious about seniors and people who are struggling in this worst inflation? Well, thank you so much for all of your love and support. If you're new to the channel, subscribe to the channel right now and click on the bell icon because we upload videos every single day for you. We will see you in the next video very soon. Till then, please take care and have a nice day.